what is up guys it's Mike H. Mario here and welcome to my YouTube channel and most of all welcome to my final playthrough of the Gothic 2 game The Path of Balear and uh, welcome to episode 2 part 2 of the city of Corinus so uh, in this particular episode I'm going to complete all the quests that I still have to do within the city of Corinus see if I can become an apprentice and uh, see if I will be able to get myself a, a better weapon and B be able to hunt with Bartok so I can deliver the skins and thus become an apprentice and uh, also prepare to go towards Onar's farm so without further ado guys let's begin In the last episode we did a bit, you know, of questing around here, but uh, we still have many, many to do, at least as far as I can remember. So there's only one way to find that out. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. Hey you! Where you going? No matter what your plans are, there'll be plenty of time later. You're right in front of the Pearl of Corinus, the Red Lantern. This is the most beautiful brothel in all of Mirtana, damn it. Sailors from the most remote corners of the world dock here just to spend a few nights in the Red Lantern. And now, it's you who has the chance, nay, the honor of spending a night with Nadia, the most passionate flower of the gods. Come on in, and you're going to experience what others cannot even dream of. I see. Very, very intriguing speech, my man. Hey, you. Hey, I can't take care of you now, baby. Talk to Bromar if you want to have some fun. I just want to ask you a few questions about those missing people. I could tell you a thing or two, That's but not here, secret. honey. Then let's go upstairs. Fine, but you get it settled with Bromar first. I don't want any trouble. Go away, don't tell me that. Are you the one who runs this place? I am Bromar, this is my house, and these are my girls. I like my girls. And if you like my girls too, then you'll pay for it 50 gold pieces. And don't get the idea of making trouble here. Are all your girls accounted for? Of course they are. Or do you think I want to go to jail over something like that? Uh, I wasn't asking about your payroll. I mean, are they all present? Or have any gone missing? Oh yeah. Actually, one of my girls has up and left. Her name's Lucia. I reported it to the militia too, but they claim they haven't found a trace of her yet. Who says things like that? How long has Lucia been missing? Several days. I don't know exactly how long. I assume she ran off with one of her suitors, eh? That bitch made off with part of my savings, a really valuable gold and dish, eh? If I get out of her, I give her what for. So how is that any business of yours, huh? Do you want to have fun or not? I want to have some fun. Fine. <laughs> You're not likely to forget the next few hours of your life anytime soon. Go upstairs with Nadja then. Have fun. Hey. Let's go upstairs. Today's your lucky day, baby. Let's go. While you walk upstairs, I'm gonna chuck with a few people. Don't tell me you didn't know that. Ten learning points. Let's strain my strength a bit. Hey, you. But no, he insisted he knew better. Tell me more about the Ring of Water. The ring is to the water mages what the paladins that. are to the fire magicians. But, unlike the Paladins, we operate in the background. You listen to the, wrong people. the Ring is a mighty weapon in the battle against the dangers that threaten the people of Corinus. But this only works as long as we keep the identity of all those secret who belong to the Ring of Water. So keep this to yourself. Sure. I agree with you completely. That's exactly what I said. 
I want to join the Ring of Water. There's nothing you can That's do fine with me. But the decision about whether you will be you accepted or not lies with the water mages alone. He doesn't see that. I can't help him. I see. Vatras said you could help me join a community. Anything. <laughs> Getting tired of being the underdog. All right. I can exert, that. and I'm sure. But the which done this one, and I. The fire. <laughs> I bet Vatras joining it's those and the. Oh. I don't want to hear that. Already had that quest. Yeah, the simple way. Already had that one. There's nothing you can do about um, it. Um. All right. The uh, information you about Lucia. He never would have thought of that himself. Because if it was newly obtained, it would have been on the top. Which in this case is not the case. Like so I already had that quest. Hey, you! That will never change. So can we talk now? We've got enough privacy up here. Bromar doesn't like to see us talk to guests during work if there's nothing in it for him. So you want to know more about the people who disappeared down here at the harbor, you do you? I don't know whether I can help you much, but at least I can tell you what became of Lucia. Tell me about Lucia. Nobody here is too sorry that she's gone. Why? I don't think there was anyone here whom she didn't try to use. She was a real bitch. Where did she disappear to? She used to see a lot of Elverich, the apprentice of Thorben, the carpenter from the lower say. part of town. I bet she's up and left with that young man. I'm staying out of it. Where could the two of them have gone? If the wolves didn't need them, I suppose they went to stay with the farmers. No Where else would they go? What else do you know? I've heard many stories about people who disappeared down here at the harbor. But I'm not so sure whether I should believe them. You should have a chat with the merchants down here. That's all I can tell you, alas. Now, what about the two of us, sweetie? You paid for it, after all. Wouldn't you like to have a little fun before you leave? It was his decision, wasn't it? Better said to know you want to have some fun. That's not what... But I'll, I'll skip Gash. Huh? And there's more okay, that was a bit weird, me. but uh, I'll skip it due to YouTube, like you know, and Twitch, even though I'm not and really currently live streaming. Me. These are kind of the boring shit that like gets that. you banned and... Uh, don't want that, you know, so I have to cut it, That's not you know, what I skip heard. it, whatever you want to call it. Which is going to be interestingly difficult with some cases, like GTA 5 in the future, something like that, you know. You hardly know Game is full with that days. kind of shit. It's better to watch out who you tell why. But, um, kind of done. There's nothing you can do about I think it. so, at any rate, so let's see. I don't want to hear that anymore. Do I have a map? No, so that I still have to talk me. with Brahim. Let's uh, let's talk with the bugger. There have been all kinds of rumors. What are you doing here? My name is Brahim. I draw maps and sell them. Since you're new here, maybe you could use a map of the city. It's quite affordable and very useful until you know your way around. These are bad times. Is it true that some townspeople have simply vanished? So I've heard, but I'm not sure whether it's really true. Just look around you. Exactly what I said. Does this rat hole look like the place where you want to spend your golden years? Tell me you didn't know that. <laughs> Small wonder that people are getting themselves out of here. Go on like this forever. Show me your maps. Don't tell me you didn't know that. Is it really true? You, one of those and Nothing's one of those. That. Because I'm rich. Come back again later. I, I'm sure to have something new for you then. I wouldn't have done that. Certainly I am not in life, but in real life. Is it really true? Hey! Oh, you landlubber. Let's wait and see what happens. Looks like you're stranded here. You look a bit pale around the gills. Never mind, my lad. All you need is a good stiff sea breeze. You listen to the don't see it, Captain. What are you doing here? Back when I was a young man, I went to sea and rode through many a big storm. No big deal, not at all. But that old tower came closest to what I call a home. I haven't been up there in ages. Why not? Ever since these scallywags took over my lighthouse, I haven't dared get closer to it than 20 feet. Really bad rabble, that. They're criminals from the Valley of Mind, you know. There was this big bang on the other side of the mountains, 
and they swarmed all over the land like flies. Now they're hiding out everywhere, even in my lighthouse. I think they're on the lookout for any ship they can raid. Ah, let them. Then at least they'd be out of my tower. Do you come to town often? I always say a town is only as good as its harbor. A harbor is the gate to the world. That's where everyone meets and where everything starts. Once the harbor goes to the dogs, the rest of the city will follow soon. He should have known better. Tell me about the harbor. The harbor of Corinus isn't what it used to be. There's nothing but riffraff hanging about. The ships don't come anymore, and trade is dead. This harbor is about to go under. You have to feel sorry for the poor guy. Why are the ships no longer coming? They all say that once the war is over, everything will be like it used to be. That's a load of bilge water. I tell you, a sailor can see when a town's going downhill. A sailor feels that in his blood. And I can tell you, forget about this harbor. It's heyday's over. I don't want to hear that anymore. What do you mean by riffraff? Look at them, the lazy rabble. Most of them don't even know what work is. All they do is drink all day and spend their last pay at the brothel. I tell you, stay away from them. Nothing's ever going to change that. So why don't you leave? Nobody would take an old sea dog like me on his ship these days. Most people think that old Jack's got the gout in his rotten old bones. And are they right? Balderdash. Once I've got those planks beneath me feet again, I'll feel like a young whippersnapper. A whippersnapper. Nice. Why haven't I heard about this before? Nice man. Nobody will learn anything. Hey! What are you doing here? I'm building a ship because I want to get out of here as fast as I can. But the way it looks right now, this ship will never be finished. Why are you in such a hurry? Soon the orcs will come and burn down the city. What makes you think that? Boy, have you noticed the paladins running around everywhere? Why do you think they're here? I tell you, they're here because the orcs will attack soon, and that won't be pretty. Can I help you somehow? Yes, you can. Find out what the paladins are planning. I want to know why they're here. And I have to know if the orcs will attack, and how far from the city they are. One of the bastards was even seen outside the city. Just bring me all the information you can get. I need to know how much time I have left to finish the boat. What's going on at the harbor? The orcs are breathing down our necks and you're asking about the harbor? I only wanted to... The biggest problem we have is that there aren't enough ships in the harbor to get us out of here. To be honest, there's only one ship here, and that belongs to the paladins. They certainly won't let us get out of here with that. Why can't you finish your ship? Oh, we have thousands of problems. The hull still isn't stable, and it's still missing a lot of boards. But I have hardly any gold left to buy new material with, and the last delivery had bugs in it. My boys don't work productively. One wants a fast ship above all else, the other one is worried about the figurehead. As if we didn't have more important things to do. Also, one of my people is simply not showing up for work anymore. I'm beginning to fear that this will delay the construction even more. You're one worker short? Yes. His name is Monty. He's vanished into thin air. That lazy pig is probably living the high life on a farm somewhere. I should never have paid him in advance. I've heard that other people have gone missing too. Just what I'm saying. That's where the evil starts. Farum the fisherman told me something similar. His buddy William is no longer around. I bet that the orcs are behind all this. Don't tell me you didn't know that. What's going on? I... That's nothing new. Yeah, yeah, I'll get your information. Well, let's see if I can kick this guy's arse. I want to fight against you. Nah, nah. Before I go up against you again, I had to... With that... I see. 
already beat it just sorry as once okay good to know then i already did i do that one Let's see okay good to skip we shall go the game twice so and technically speaking it is indeed an Asia food oh well doesn't matter I'm gonna still loot it all collect it all and then see how my luck is when opening those clampers and all those things chest yeah I did I'm pretty sure I did there you are at last I've been waiting here for hours just a moment you're not a merchant from town are you where is Baltram Baltram you're waiting for a merchant smart kid aren't you that's what I just said, isn't it? Uh, that good-for-nothing junk merchant seems to have forgotten me. If only I could get my hands on him. Who are you? I don't see how that's any of your business. But if you must know, my name is Skip. Does that ring a bell? Who? Are you telling me you've never heard of Skip? Holy shit! Where do you live? I'm one of Corinus's most wanted criminals. Me and my boys have been the scourge of the waters around this crummy island for years. Come on, you must have heard of me. But of course, it's all coming back to me now. Honestly, you've really heard of me before? Oh shit, and I had been thinking of strolling into town. Good thing I didn't. The militia would have put me in the slammer right away. Where do you come from? You want to know where our hideout is? If I tell you that, I might as well invite the militia to arrest me. And, in case you would like to pay us a visit, it wouldn't help you in the least. The island of Corinus is large, and no one ever gets to where we are anyway. Unless they have a cog or some other ship. And then you'd have to find your way through the cliffs as well. Nobody gets through there unless they know the secret path. There are only two people who know the path, and you're not one of them. A lot of citizens are missing, and everything seems to indicate that you're not quite innocent in the matter. Uh, damn it. It's not what you think it is. Do I look like a slave trader to you? No, I only transport goods. What they are, and where they come from, is no concern of mine. We have shipped all kinds of things for those swine. First, it was just regular stuff. Well, sometimes it may have been contraband. But then they started to kidnap the inhabitants of the city. No idea what they're planning to do with them. All we did was ferry them across. 
Who are you talking about? The bandits, of course. Who else? The filthy scum who are making themselves at home all over the island. And not just here, around Corinus. Just bandits isn't good enough for me. I want a name. A name? You want to know who's leading the bandits? Damn it! What was that bastard's name again? Hmm. I just can't recall his name. Even if it wasn't all that complicated. But I can show you where to find the boss of the gang in this part of Corinus. Have you got a decent map? Here, I've got a map of Corinus. That's good. Let me draw in the hideout of this fellow. I remember his name now. Dexter. Yes, I think they called him Dexter. Here's your map. Let me loot this uh, junk and the chest as well, of course. And now we're gonna go back into the city of Corinth. See you later, Skip. Alright, so how much is Lady Luck smiling upon me? Nothing there. Nothing there. Not bad. Could have been worse. Let's go into the city. Since I haven't been here yet, apparently, there will be quite a few NPCs um, which I have to talk to. Let me first check Lord Andre. Enos be with you, stranger. What brings you to me? I've got an important message for Lord Hagen. Well, you stand before one of his men. What is this about? The hosts of orcs are led by Dra- I know that the armies of the orcs are growing ever stronger. You don't have to tell me that is what you wish to report to Lord Hagen. He would tear your head from your shoulders if you wasted his time with such stories. And I'm sure that you're clever enough to know that for yourself. So what is this really about? It's about a sacred artifact, the Eye of Innos. The Eye of Innos. I have never heard of it, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. If there truly is an artifact of this name, only the highest members of our order would know anything about it, in any case. That's why I have to talk to Lord Hagen himself. Lord Hagen receives only paladins, or those who are in the service to paladins. It is beneath his dignity to waste his time with members of the common folk. Why are you paladins in town? The goals of our mission are secret. I can only tell you that there is no danger for the citizens of the town. You need not worry. I want to take up service with the Paladins. Good. I can well use every able man here, no matter what his reasons for joining us. If you place yourself in the service of the Paladins, I shall help you get an audience with Lord Hagen. However, I have my orders only to accept citizens of the town into the militia. My commander is afraid that spies or saboteurs could sneak in. He wants to limit the risk this way. 
Therefore, you must first be a citizen of the town. Whether this rule makes sense or not is disputable, but orders are orders. Now, should you want to uh, see uh, the Paladin playthrough, uh, check out my playthrough of Enos in Gothic 2. And if you want to see the Mercenary, check out the playthrough of Adenos. And if you're looking for uh, the uh, Mage of Fire, then you're in the right place with the playthrough of Belear. Is there a faster way to join you? Hmm. You're really serious about this, aren't you? Good. Listen, I have a problem. If you solve it for me, I shall see to it that you are accepted into the militia. But the most important thing is, you must not breathe a word of it to anyone. What's your problem? Recently, there have been a number of thefts in the city. Thus far, we have not been able to capture anyone. The thieves are simply too skillful. The scum know their business. I'm sure that we're dealing with an organized gang. It would not amaze me if there were a thieves guild in Corinus. Find the leaders of the gang and hunt them down. Then I shall see to it that you are accepted into the militia, regardless of whether or not you are a citizen. But you must say nothing about our agreement. I don't want to join the militia, for my friend, but I will still take care of the thieves. Where should I start looking for the thieves? If I knew that, I'd go there myself. I can only tell you this much. We recently turned the entire harbor district upside down and found nothing. Absolutely nothing. The people there are not very talkative, particularly if you wear the armor of a paladin. But you are an outsider. They will not distrust you so quickly. You could ask around the harbor first, but be careful. If the people there realize that you are working for the paladins, you will learn nothing. I see. What should I do once I've found one of the thieves? If it's a matter of a lackey, a henchman, or some small fry, it would be best if you avoid a fight. You should rather come to me and report. I shall then see to it that the fellow winds up behind bars. The city guard could intervene in an open battle, and you would not have the opportunity of explaining to them what is going on. Furthermore, there is a bounty for every rotten apple you put behind bars. However, if you locate the leader's hideout, well, then you probably won't be able to avoid a fight. Don't worry about the minor details, my friend. They will meet that doom eventually. What should I expect with the militia? Let me make one thing clear. To be a soldier of the militia means much more than strolling through the city in a uniform. It is a dirty and even bloody job. Once you are one of us, a great deal of work will be waiting for you. But it is worth it. Besides the pay, you might someday have the chance of becoming a holy warrior of Inos. Do I look like I would support Inos, eh? Fuck Inos. About those missing people. Just leave me alone with that. I've got other problems. Good day to you, sir. Hey, you! How's your duty? Oh, these boys swing their swords like farmers. But when I'm done with them, every single one of them will be a tough, hard bastard. What's it like with the militia? Lord Andre is our commander now. The militia used to report to the governor. <laughs> he had no idea what we do here. But Lord Andre knows what he's doing. He takes good care of the men. Everyone who starts here gets some decent armor and a good weapon. And there are bonuses if you've done a good job. He pays a bounty for every criminal captured. I see. Can you also train me in sword fighting? Lord Andre has ordered that we train everyone who is in a position to defend the city. But that's only true for combat training. All other kinds of training are reserved for the militia. Can you at least halfway handle a weapon? I think so. All right. You can start when you're ready. What are the advantages of one or two-handed weapons? Quite simple. With a one-handed weapon, you're faster. That can be a considerable advantage in battle. Two-handed weapons are more ponderous. You have to fight with foresight, but you can do a lot more damage when you're hit. Where should I start with one-handed or two-handed weapons? That's entirely up to you. If you specialize in only one type of weapon, you automatically learn the other at the same time. If, for instance, you're good at fighting with one-handed swords, but still a beginner with two-handed weapons, 
Your two-handed skills will go up as well whenever you train with a one-hander. In that case, the training is more exhausting than if you train with both types of weapons. Just start and you'll soon see what I'm talking about. I see. Wait a minute. What do you want? Peck isn't here, so you can't get anything. Come back later. I want to get stronger. Of course you do. But so long as you aren't one of us, or a paladin, I won't help you. All right, F you then, man. F you. I'm gonna loot everything that's not nailed down. Now I don't know how to pick locks yet, so I can't open the chest, but we will learn that soon enough. Are they still having that little meeting over there? Yeah. Okay, so I'll come back later. Alright, so let me talk with a few of the uh, NPCs around here. Nothing surprises me anymore. That's really not my Hey! Problem. Are you looking for a job? Sure. What's it about? It my errand boy hasn't come back, and I'm waiting for a delivery really from the farmer Akil. And how much is it worth to you? I'll give you 50 gold pieces. Fine, That's I'm really in. Not my okay. Just tell Akil that I sent you. He'll give you a package. You Bring it to me. I'm not telling you anything new. Where can I find Akil's farm? Just go out here through the Nobody east gate and follow the path me. to the southeast. After a short Don't while, you'll come really to a stone that. stairway. Go up that, and from but there, no, you'll already be able better. to see Akil's farm. But that's terrible. Nobody will learn anything from me. You're that doing business surprising. with pirates? What? Who told you that? I talked to one of them. Do you really he seems that? to be waiting for you in his bay. What can he you do? He's a hard time. Everybody has to look after his own. Who says things like that? That doesn't surprise me. You will me. bear the consequences for this. Hey, listen. I'll answer. tell you There's all that I know, and in return, you won't rat that on me, really okay? True. You don't say. That was obvious. What is along. it you're trading? I mostly Nothing supply them with it. food, and for that. They give me the finest rum that that's to be had in Corinus. I agree with you completely. That's what I've always said. What do you know about the pirates? That's been known they live in a time. remote part of the island of Corinus. It can only be reached with a cog or some other things. ship, as far as I know. That's been known the citizens of Corinus fear them, quite rightly so. For they're nothing but a bunch of nasty cutthroats. Still, if you ask me, they're nowhere near as bad as the bandits. Really? How interesting. I'm not telling you anything new. I could take care of this deal for you. That would be great. I cannot leave Corinus at the moment. You can't keep anything to That's really Here, not my take problem. this package and tell Skip not to be That's so stingy with the rum this time. It should be at least three He's bottles. Talks it's a bad much. business. That was all really I wanted that. to know. Show me your wares. That's been known a long time. That's not what I heard. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. Why are you looking so doubtful? Order of the Honorable I Lord Hagen, the, the following the decree is water. hereby enacted. So, this are you a onward, member too? Lord what if Andre I am? Will take the then I would tell you that Lares wants to be relieved from All his post down at the city harbor. All the citizens of this city who have martial Fine. skills if at their disposal so, are I'll here with that urge to join the royal so. militia. I see. Nothing surprises me anymore. Thanks. Really? How interesting. Innos be with you, stranger. I'm no better if you're looking for a good selection for the traveler, then you're in the right place. But I'm warning you, if you're planning on helping yourself without paying, 
I'll call the city guard. The Just a moment. Do I look like a thief? Bah! Honestly, I witnessed it you won't be the first one to make off with my things today. You hardly ever asked. To believe these days. Somebody stole from you. I can't prove it. The fellow was damn clever. Introduce himself as Ringaru, if that really is his right name. He's been hanging around the marketplace the last few days. And it's gonna get I only looked worse. away for a moment, and my purse was gone. That was obvious all along. I could get your gold back for you. Oh, and That's why would you do that? Will it ever change? It. I'm looking for clues to the Thieves Guild. I might times. well be able to help you. Listen. If you get my gold back for me from that Renguru fellow, I'll tell you what I know. Really? How interesting. Why didn't you call the city guard? The guards only respond if a thief is caught in the act. And when I noticed my purse was missing, the bastard was already gone. That's what I heard. How much gold was in that purse? 50 gold pieces. That's quite a lot in these crappy times. I'll see what I can do. Be careful. If you just knock the bastard down, the There's city guard will get involved. It. Lately, things have been getting really it's tough here. Since the paladins came to town, the guards have been cracking down on brawlers. So think of something. I shall. I can't take care of everything for everybody. Alric says you got his sword. Do you mean that ragged fellow who traded his weapon to me for a few torches and chunks of meat? That's him. I still have the sword. How much do you want for it? Well, for you, 50 gold pieces. I can get it for free, I but uh, since I've done I that help. twice now, on the uh, playthrough of Adonos and the playthrough of Enos, I'm gonna purchase it for 50 gold. Okay. Change. But uh, if you want to have it for free, first complete That's his quest with uh, Rangaroo, get his gold back, and he will give you it to you, you for free. Me. Here's 50 gold pieces. Give me Alric's sword then. Here you go. That was a good deal. He can't keep anything to himself. That's really not my fault. Show me your wares. These are bad times. Uh, that's a ring that I like to have. Ring of the Warlords. Who says which isn't like in uh, Vanilla Gothic 2, as far as I know. That's I couldn't purchase gossip. it with my pl uh, Paladin. And that one was that. without Heights of Power, so I think Nothing Heights of Power adds anymore. this one, but uh, it's 800 apiece. That's not what I heard. Two rings, one belt, the belt is a thousand, something like that. Don't tell this to anyone. That's really not my that. problem. And it's gonna get even worse. Just give me a bit here to sell a couple That's of been things. Known a long time. I won't tell her a thing from now on. Why haven't I heard about this before? Really? How interesting. You Some hardly know who to believe these so. days. He had better shut up. Hear ye, inhabitants of Ferenis. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following Lord decree Lord. is hereby by reason of the Everyone is to begin training in the skills of combat immediately. It's a bad business. Shut up. You should have known anything new. But what are you doing here? I'm a novice from the monastery. I run errands for the magicians and also the paladins. I have provided the three innkeepers in the city with wine from the monastery. That's what really I thought. Who are the three innkeepers? One of them is the good man here behind the bar. Then there is Karagon, really? who has his tavern on the Temple Square, and Cardiff, the no owner of the tavern in the Harbor District. You hardly know who to believe these days. What can you tell me about the monastery? We novices seek enlightenment in prayer to Innos and learn the principles of faith from the magicians. We serve them as we serve Innos, and prepare ourselves for the union with the fire. That's not really what my husband that. Well, take me to the monastery. Forget it. Do you know how many creatures I had to evade on the way? No, when I think of all those bad. blood flies, wolves, and goblins, I'm glad that I don't have to leave here anymore. Besides, you can't enter the monastery anyway. 
But why not? Entrance is only permitted to magicians, paladins, and novices. How can I become a novice? If a man feels the deep desire... Hey, just tell me what the conditions are. You need the offerings, a sheep, and... A thousand gold pieces. How am I supposed to get that much gold? Since you obviously don't know anyone who would pay that for you, you'll simply have to go to work. Where can I find a sheep? From the farmers, of course. But you won't get one for nothing. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit order of martial law is immediately declared and all all civilian judges are to hand Do over their duties to the royal paladin. Jorah says you've got his money. Damn it! The I'm honorable here. Lord Andre is commanded to punish every Ooh, crime or broke. act of resistance against the king's guards most I'm severely. Who does that? Every inhabitant of Cor Don't bother. I don't want to hear that. I don't care about your message. Hey, what's up? Yeah, as long as the paladins don't have any new assignments for me, I, I can have myself a couple of beers here. <laughs> what more could you ask? You're working for the paladins? Yeah, I, I report to them on the situation in the city. At the moment, everything is quiet. It's totally obvious. How are things with the orcs? No reason to worry. We in the city guard and the paladins have everything under control. Go home and let us do our work. We're watching over the town and its citizens. Oh. Would you like another beer? Mm, there's nothing better than a cool ale. Now that's typical, isn't it? It's not what exactly I heard. what I said. You were about to say Everybody something about the problem. orcs. Oh yeah, yeah, right. The well, orcs are change. absolutely no threat to the city. Works all day too. Mm, they're stuck in the uh, Valley yeah, of Mines, and and the pass is is held by the paladins. Can't keep anything to themselves. <laughs> not even a meat bug could get through there. Never knew it's that. totally uh, obvious. Would you like another beer? Well, I won't say no to a decent pint. He can't it's keep anything to himself. Nobody will learn They've even spotted me. an orc outside of town. Yeah, right. He had better the dangerous shot. orc outside the city. A real monster of an orc. Well, he's bound to attack the city soon. Listen, we'll... Kick that fat orc in his know who to believe fat ass days. if he comes too close to the city. Don't tell this to anyone. <sighs> Got it? I see. Do you really believe that? Would you like another beer? <clears throat> A tasty bitter That's ale is absolutely hesitation. the best. Don't tell me you didn't know that. I can't take care of everything for everybody. You know, do you don't have to meet someone who'll treat you I'll to a beer. <clears throat> You're all right. You hardly know who to believe these days. All right, so let's steal. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the, the key of one of the towers, as well as a uh, golden plate which belongs to Onar's wife and Onar. Now, if you're gonna run around here, you gotta be whooped, you know, you gotta be killed instantly. At least you gotta be knocked out, and uh, since as soon as you start, stand up, they will knock you down again. So basically, either they will kill you, or they will just knock you down for entering this area. But, as far as I can remember, uh, they will kill you, so uh, be very, very careful. But I'm only here for one, the tower key, and two, the uh, golden plate wedding present of Onar. Because, uh, uh, 
That tower has a uh, particularly better weapon than I'm currently wearing. Will it ever change? Hey you! I have a proposition for you. That's what do you I want? I want my old stall in the marketplace back. Sarah That's snatched it away from me. But she has had that spot long enough. Really? I want her to give up the stall. And what's my part in this? Is it I will true? give you a letter to stick in her pocket. Then you go to Andre yeah, and tell him that Sarah is selling weapons to Onar. She lands in prison, people. you pocket the bounty, and I and get the stall. Anyone. You have two days to accomplish this. I agree What's in it for me? Completely. When I have the stall, you will get a weapon it's from me, and a damned good one. Two handed eggs. What will happen if I refuse to do that? That would be that. truly stupid of you. Because you see, you really I know that. that you're an escaped convict. If that gets around, it could do either. considerable harm to your situation in the city. You hardly know who to believe these days. You know? Uh, all right, let's do it. Let's if do I it. Hadn't seen it with my own eyes. All right, you're a clever lad. Here is the letter. How am I supposed to foist the letter on her? Let her show you her wares, and while she does, you hide the letter Listen on her. People. And bear in mind, I am an influential man don't in the city, that. so don't try to play me for a fool. That's been known a long time. Show me your wares. Take shot. your pick. It will I give you this you weapon. Completely. Whoop to do, and uh, if you choose Sarah's side, she will give you this one. Which is uh, way better. I mean, come on. 740. <laughs> so, uh, that doesn't surprise karma is going to be a bitch today. I've got to go. Suit yourself. You're going to go to jail, man. Hear ye, inhabitants of jail for you. Completely. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, How strange. The following decree is hereby it seems to me that I have Martial met you before, Traveler. Well, great are the mysteries, the mysteries of time and space. Oh, please forgive my rudeness, son of patience. The Honorable I have not Lord even greeted you yet. Welcome, friend. Or act of Take a seat on my humble guard. And enjoy a pipe in peace. Every inhabitant of Corinus who is guilty of a who crime are you? is to report My name to Lord is Andre Abu Jin ibn Jadir ibn Omar Khalid ben Haji al Sharidi. I am a seer and a prophet, an astrologer, and a purveyor of tobacco. These are bad times. What kind of tobacco do you offer? My pipes are filled with spicy, refreshing That's apple tobacco. Help yourself whenever you want, son of adventure. Me anymore. Do you have other tobacco That's as well? Secret. I offer only the very best tobacco. This it's apple plant is a symphony from my homeland, the Southern I Isles. But of course, I'm always open to trying a different sort of me. tobacco. If somebody should succeed in say. producing a really good tobacco. How's that done? I'm no better Start with my apple tobacco as a basis and then try really? combining it with another ingredient. This is done that was at an alchemist's bench, provided you know the essentials of alchemy. Now there are three, three versions that time. you can make. You can make a, a tobacco with Someone's swamp weed, which is, you know, um, which is, is really like true? wheat reefer, but okay. Um, the second option That's what is... I've you know, combining the apple tobacco with Nobody murky mushroom, from me. both of which he will not like. The one that he yours. likes the most and will only accept is the one Nobody with honey. Nobody will learn anything from me. Where can I get apple tobacco? I That's shall terrible. give you two portions. It is up to you, in it's your wisdom, to do with them whatever you want. That's if you crave anything. more, then direct your steps toward Zuris, the master of potions. It. He produces this tobacco, Honestly, and he sells it too. Can you make me a prophecy? My services are yours for a so modest fee. Oh, father of generosity. How much I'm do you want? You for a poultry, 25 coins. It's gonna get even I shall risk a glance through time for you. But remember, would have of that the future is always uncertain. These are bad All times. I can do is glimpse some fragments of time. It's really not my problem. Tell me about the future. Honestly, All right, so. seeker of knowledge. I shall now enter a state of trance. Himself. Are you ready? I don't believe that. 
orcs. They are guarding an entry. Really? An old tunnel. The Valley of Mines. Man in shining armor. A magician. Your friend is with them. He is waiting for you. Fire! An attack! That's been known a, a long mighty time. creature. The flames. That's what I've always said. Many shall die. He doesn't see what that. is that? And it's a gonna get city. Worse. Ruins. It's not what I heard. Quar Holdron in Jakanda. He, he is up. summoned. Nothing so Quar Holdron in Jakanda. It's gonna get even worse. I'm sorry. The vision is over. There's nothing more I can see. But that's terrible. All right, so let's Hear catch ye, up. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit fella. order of the Honorable Should Lord Hagen, the following decree is hereby enacted. Don't tell me Due to the general situation, the forest and, and wilderness and near the city again. are to be avoided for your own protection. Furthermore, any contact with the rebelling peasantry in the surrounding areas is strictly... Gotcha. Hey, 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 what do you want from me? Huh? You stole from Jorah in broad daylight, and he even saw you do it. So I've come to tell you that you're a lousy thief, and that... And now, you tell me who you are. I'm nothing but a poor wretch, trying to make ends meet one way or another. Well, what else can I do? I can't find a job in town. All right, I see. Spare me your whining. I deserve a share of the loot. All right, looks like I have no choice. I'll share half with you. All right, give me half then. Here's your half, and now let me go. Fine. I should turn you into the militia. What else do you want? I've got nothing left. Let me go, man! Why would I want to do that? In the city, it's always good to know the right people and to stay on their good side. I could put in a good word for you. I, I can't and won't say more. The rest is up to you. Get lost and don't show your face around here again. Oh. You won't regret this. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. We all make slip-ups. Besides, I'm evil. Well, Martial not entirely true, but shut up, man. I can hear you up here. Same message over and over and over and over again. Honorable Lord Andre is commanded to punish every crime or act of resistance against the king's guards most severely. Every inhabitant of Corinus who is guilty of a crime is to report immediately to Lord Andre. I'm just searching, you know, the rooftops for items, bag of gold, a spell scroll, anything useful Exactly what I said. And be careful if you fall down, you're really a dead man. A dead man oh, not walking. You think? I can't believe that. Maybe that would be a problem. It's better to watch. Alright, so let's deliver the package to our good friend the pirate.
almost enough for the ring. Need two more gold pieces. So that one is GG. But, you know, I don't think I will purchase them for now. Because one, it's still too expensive. And two, I have uh, better ideas with the gold. I've got a package for you from Baltram. What? He's sending me an errand boy? Scared shitless, is he? Oh well, what can you expect from such a puny penny pincher? He says he wants three bottles of your rum in return. Ha <laughs> ha, wouldn't he like that? First he makes me wait forever, doesn't even show up in person. Then he has the nerve to make demands. Here, give him two bottles. That's enough for him. Where did you take those people? I already told you. I'm not going to tell you where our bay is. I will find out, Skip. With or without your help, I will find out. Alright, so there are two things that we're gonna do. One is we're gonna react on Kantar's little threat by throwing that little bugger into jail. And second, I'm gonna deliver the wine or rum, whatever it is, to the bugger Baltram. And then go to the water mage and the fire mage for my blessings of the gods. Yeah, I need the blessings of the gods. What do you do? Honestly, I witnessed it myself. I'd have gone about it differently. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. I never knew that. Oh, right, right. Uh, uh, let's see, give Kenthar a little wake-up call. That's really not my problem. Don't tell me he might know that I'm a convict, but I don't give a shit who knows I'm a convict. I've come to collect the bounty for a criminal. Kanthar the merchant is trying to get rid of Sarah. Sarah? The weapons merchant in the marketplace? I was supposed to foist a letter on Sarah, which claimed that she's supplying weapons to Onar. I see. I shall gladly pay the bounty for that bastard. He is already as good as behind bars. Indeed, bastard he is. But cost me 500 gold in the What next do you chapter. want here? But I don't give a care about gold. I warned you, but you wouldn't listen. We will discuss this later. Now get lost! I want to rest! You threatened me, my man. That's not a smart thing to do. Cause I don't take threats lightly. He, he's, he could be glad that he's not dead. These are bad times. Besides his reward on both ways, whether you have his pass. Ah, customer, what can I do for you? Or not, you know, whether you have the pass or not, his reward is shitty. I'm looking for a room. Ah, you're in the right place then. What does it cost to spend the night? Absolutely nothing. The paladins are responsible for the lodging of all travelers. So can I stay the night here for free? Yes, yes. Just go up the stairs. We still have one or two beds free. Why do the paladins pay for everything? I don't know what that's all about either. For one thing, I think they want to get all the poor suckers off the streets so they don't make any mischief. And for another, they want to get on the good side of the traveling traders. Now that the farmers are rebelling, we have to rely on the traders for provisions. Besides, I think they want to improve the morale in the city a bit. Lord Andre has even arranged for free beer to be given out at the Gala Square. I see. Well, let me talk with Sarah and claim my pirate sword reward. Oh. Hey! 
Ah, there you are again. Canthor was trying to trick you and to get your booth for himself, but I've turned him over to the city guard. Then you've made an enemy of a dangerous man. I've known the bastard for a long time, and he's always wanted my place for himself. Take this weapon as a token of my gratitude. Which is worth about 700 at merch price. If you sell it, you get about 200 or something. Which is better than the 40 gold piece X, which you only get about five. How's business? When the Paladins came, I first thought that it was a good business opportunity. But they let Herod make their weapons, and neither Hacka nor I make even one gold piece off them. Moreover, the farmers no longer supply us with food, and all the prices have gone up. It's only a small consolation that the Paladins are paying my hotel bill. What's the problem with the farmers? They refuse to deliver their goods. Now that the ships no longer come in, the city depends entirely on the supplies provided by the farmers, of course. An owner, the largest farmer, has hired mercenaries to protect his farm from the city guards. Otherwise, they'd simply snatch the goods for themselves. But the mercenaries don't just guard Onar's farm. They come as far as the small farms outside of town to intimidate the farmers. I saw them as I was passing Akil's farm. I wouldn't like to be in his shoes now. Where will I find Akil's farm? If you go out of the east gate here and follow the road to the right, you'll come to a stairway. It leads up to Akil's farm. But I wouldn't go there now. The mercenaries are certainly still there. Show me your wares. How much strength? 60. Hmm, I'm gonna keep it for now. Because uh, I have to train my strength a bit anyways. A fighting pike. 500. You're mad. You listen to the wrong people. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following decree is... I got the rum from Skip, but he gave me no more than two bottles. Damn expensive, that. Who does he think he is? Well, give it here, then. I can't give you much for it now. This here's gotta be enough. Ten gold pieces. Ready? What a lazy pig. About the thief. Yes, how's it going? Have you caught him? And much more importantly, do you have my gold? He got away from me. And what about my gold? Did he get away with it? Here's the 50 gold pieces he stole from you. Inos be praised. There is still justice in the city. I want part of the gold as a reward. If it's gold you want, then hunt down the thieves and collect the bounty from Lord Andre. Don't you dare to go to bed. Hey, you! What do you know about the Thieves' Guild? Right, listen up. You haven't heard anything of what I'm about to tell you from me, capiche? There are shady characters who frequent the Dockside Inn. I bet the landlord knows a thing or two. If you're planning to track down the thieves, you should go talk to him. You could act like you're up to something crooked, for example. Maybe he'll fall for it, but be very careful. These people are not to be trifled with. Neither am I. Wait a minute. I am Hacken, the weapons dealer. Every man should carry a weapon these days, especially when venturing outside of the city walls. Tell me more about the area around the city. It's gotten too dangerous out there, because of the bandits for one thing, and also on account of wild beasts. Even the animals don't seem to get enough to eat in these crappy times. They're venturing closer to the city all the time. Do you know anything about the Paladins? Yes. Those guys are ruining my business. All you can buy in this entire town is a short sword at most. They've helped themselves to anything that's longer than a foot and a half. In return, I now get to live in the hotel free of charge. Tch. Where do you get your weapons from? Harad the Smith has been my supplier up to now. 
Now all he does is make stuff for the Paladins. He works for those guys day and night like a madman. Without pay. He thinks it's his duty. All I can offer you now is my remaining stock. What do you know about the disappearances of the citizens of Corinus? I have seen many pass through the Eastern City Gate. Some of those who came, I had never seen before in my life. And many of those who went out never came back. But what happened the other day was really quite strange. There was this fellow who came here. I think his name is Joe. He bragged that he would soon come into some serious money. He claimed that he knew how to get into one of the city towers where the militia keep their arms. I haven't seen him since, even though I used to bump into him around the same time every day. I reported this to the militia. I thought that maybe he had been caught and thrown into the dungeon. But Lord Andre had no idea what I was talking about. He didn't even know the fella. Harrod told me about the attack by bandits. Oh? And? He'll give me his approval to be accepted as an apprentice if I hunt down the bandits. <laughs> Good old Harrod. That must be his way of saying he's sorry that he can't produce any weapons for me at the moment. What do you know about the bandits? What do I know about them? They robbed me on my way to the city. And I'm not the only one. They've been up to their tricks for quite a while. The militia tried to track them down but without any success. Do you know who in the militia took part in the search? The fellow's name is Pablo. He and a few others went looking for the bandits, but they didn't find them. Do you know where I can find Pablo? He patrols around the city. You'll find him either at the Temple Square or in the lower part of town. Where did they hold you up? Near Akil's farm. Just go out of the city gate from here. Follow the road to the right. After a while, you'll get to a few steps. The bastards came from there. I bet they have their hideout back there in the woods. I'll deal with it. What? You want to take on the bandits? By yourself? You're quite a good fighter, huh? How much the is the matter worth to you? You want to get in Harrod's good books, don't you? I don't think I should have to pay you for this. Fine. For this time only, I will do it for free. Show me your wares. Now keep in mind that most of these weapons are added due to heights of power. Because uh, at the early game, on default, without heights of power, you will not have the, these kind of damage weapons. At least, not that I can recall, but uh, a thousand for that one. I do want it though. But I will get it later. Hear ye, inhabitants of Corinus. By the explicit order of the Honorable Lord Hagen, the following decree is hereby enacted. The security measures for the protection of the upper quarter someone. will be further strengthened. The guards me on the gates are ordered to interpret the law in the strictest sense in order to prevent unauthorized entry. How's the situation? At the moment, it's quiet. Only the bandits outside the city are causing us problems. What do you know about the bandits? They've all come from that blasted mining colony. But there are several splinter groups. Some are holed up in the mountains, and others have joined up with Ona, the landowner. But it's the bandits outside of town who cause the most problems. They're the reason that none of the merchants venture beyond the city gates now. What do you know about the bandits who robbed Hacken the merchant? Oh, that matter. Don't remind me. As far as we know, they're responsible for a lot of the attacks on merchants. Those rats have crawled into their holes and don't dare come out again. Once, we were able to track them down and follow them. But we broke off pursuit in the woods outside the city. There's too many beasts roaming around there. It's much too dangerous. But there's one more thing. A few of the stolen goods have shown up in Corinus. This means that they know how they can smuggle the wares into town and sell them. Yeah, we suspect they have a fence in the city, but we haven't been able to catch the guy yet. If you find out anything about the business, remember Lord Andre has posted a bounty for the fence. Where did the bandits who had my wanted poster come from? Aha! So it is your mug after all. Why didn't you admit that right away, huh? 
What do you want it for? I don't know. Honest. Yeah, yeah, I know. Let me tell you something. If I thought you were in cahoots with those bandits, you'd already be cooling your heels in the slammer. Understood? Still, I'd better report this incident to Lord Andre. But to answer your question, we picked them up near the landowner's place. But they didn't look like Onar's people. I think they're part of a smaller group which is holed up in the mountains near Onar's farm. But if you intend to go there, let me warn you. Those cutthroats make short work of everyone. I'll remember that. And there arose all creatures, trees as well as animals. Lares said that you could help me get into the Monastery of the Fire Magicians. Is that your choice? The way of the fire? Yes, I want to become a fire magician. As far as I know, they gladly accept novices in their monastery. So why would you need my help? Lares mentioned that they demand a tribute before they let anyone into the monastery. I cannot grant you entry into the monastery myself. I am a water mage, as you know, but I am very well acquainted with Darren, the fire magician. He spends most of his time in the marketplace, collecting alms for his church. But I have heard that he is not only in town to raise some funds. He told me about a statuette that was stolen from him. It was very important to him. He will surely allow you to enter the monastery if you can get it back for him. Of course, if you should decide to join the Circle of Fire, you can still become a member of the Ring. If you prove yourself worthy, that is. About those missing people. Yes? Let me tell you what I know. I have found out that the bandits are responsible for the disappearances here. The leader of the bandits is named Dexter. He is responsible for the kidnappings. I knew Dexter back in the penal colony. He was working for the ore baron Gomez then. He certainly will remember you. Uh, you should be careful. I think you're on the right track. Just carry on. was pleased with what had arisen. And it's gonna get even worse. You listen to the wrong people. I don't believe that. I wouldn't have done that. Hey! I can't take care of everything. There's nothing though. you can do about it. Honestly, I have talked I to Baltram. He will find someone to relieve you. Ah, very good. Then we can finally leave here. He you had better keep my aquamarine ring for now. I assume it will come in handy for you until you get itself. your own. These are bad times. You already know what I think. Do you know anything about a thieves' guild in town? The questions you ask. Of course, there's a thieves' guild here, just like in every big city. And every petty pickpocket or fence is probably connected to it somehow. I don't believe that. Do you know where I can find the thieves' guild? <laughs> no offense. But even if I knew, I wouldn't tell you anything. These people usually react very sensitively to things like that. If you want to get involved with them, you should be very careful. Teach me something. Do you really think? It works all day, too. Good. Your strength has increased. 
Who says things like that? Nothing surprises me anymore. You better shut up. I don't want to hear that. Hey, I'm you! My own eyes. Teach me something. That's not what I Let's heard. wait and see what happens. He had better shut up. Do you really believe that? That's not what I heard. That's me that. Hey, you! And it's gonna get even worse. That's been known a long time. There's nothing else I can Please teach you. You Why become too good. And he works all day, too. I agree with you completely. That's not what Let's I heard. wait and see what happens. You've really? already gotten oh, more dexterous. And he works all day, too. You should have known that. Who says things like that? All right, so let's quickly talk with Lima. I totally forgot to uh, commentate. My apologies, ladies and gentlemen. Here's your money back. Wonderful. Nice doing Oops. business with you. No, I didn't want to do that one. Just give me a quick second here. You don't have to ask hey. You listen to the wrong people. Everybody knows by now. Come back. That's terrible. You've already gotten more decks. And he works all day too. Alright. That's not what my husband is. What is next? I already borrowed from Lamar. I'm not gonna pay it back so that he will at some point attack me. Um could go with Barsper, but uh, um, it's Barsper, Bartok, my apologies. But let me first get the approval of the Fire Mage. And let's see if I can get myself hold of a thousand gold pieces before I will talk with the mage. You don't say. That's an open ah, there you are again. There I am again. He'd better shut Show up. me your wares. Honestly, I witnessed it myself. And it's going to get even worse. These are bad times. Don't tell this. Oh, you are not the one. That doesn't matter. Don't tell her a thing from now on. That's not what my husband thinks. Uh, don't have the citizen clothing yet, really? Who says okay. things like that? And he works all day too. Well, let, let me quickly get the uh, Honestly, belt of the I warlords. These are bad times. Girdle of the warlords. Everybody knows by now. I don't believe that. And he works all day, too. That's not what my husband thinks. I'm Zurus, master of potions. That's Do you need an me. essence of healing or a magic elixir? Then you've come to the That's right place. Do you brew your own potions? That. No, I either get them from the monastery or I buy them from Constantino, that. the alchemist. If you're interested in really brewing potions, then talk to him. He needs an assistant, you don't say. but he's too pig-headed to hire someone himself. He's just as stubborn That's as a mule. He always passes me when he goes out on the East Gate to Who collect plants for his that? potions. Where exactly does Constantino know. gather his herbs? He always goes through the Eastern City Gate here and then disappears into the wilderness to the left. He once told me that just about everything grows there, except don't for King Sorrel. Has Constantino ever told you where to find King Sorrel? I once heard him say that the stuff grows near stone circles. Near Lobart's farm. That's a farm near the other gate. There's one of those stone circles. I think it's on a hill. It used to be a grave or something. Really, how interesting. I see. Oh, thanks for the information. 
What can I do for you? Are you seeking spiritual comfort? Do you want to direct a prayer to our Lord Enos or donate some gold for his church? He can't keep anything to himself. I need to talk to the paladins. Can you help me get to them? Well, you need access to the upper end of town. However, this is allowed only to citizens and the city guard. And of course, to us magicians of fire. How can I become a fire magician? You must join our order so as a novice. When you have served for a time, perhaps That's you will be accepted secret. into the ranks of the magicians. However, Honestly, the path to acceptance is long and full of work and study. Okay, it's going to get even worse. Now, as soon as I will join the really? ring, well, well, the novices, I will explain a bit on why things. this he in particular, the fire mage is going to be in the build of Belial in more detail a bit, you know. Really, how interesting. I can't take care of everything. I've come to get your blessing. That's good. That's good. Then you will probably want to donate gold to the Holy Church of Enos, won't you? Actually, That's I terrible. wanted your blessing so I can sign on as an apprentice in the lower part of town. Knows but away. my son, without a modest donation to the church, that. it is impossible for me to bless you. Go How away. else can I be certain I of your good myself. intentions toward That's the Holy terrible. Church of Inos? Go away, don't tell me. So, how much does a donation usually run to here? Who says well, that depends on what percentage you want to give, son. Let me see how much you brought. You have more than 50 gold coins. Donate 25 to Innos and receive his blessing. I bless you in the name of Innos, for he is light and righteousness. You don't say. And if That's you have less than 25, then he will do it for free. Everybody At least with zero, he will most definitely do it for free. That's why I That's bought the belt. Really? But uh, I got 58 left, so I got Honestly, it for 25 instead of 50. Myself. You know, win-win. Where do you come from? I come from the Monastery of the Magicians, which lies in the mountains. We really? accept How everyone there who is pure of heart and feels the desire to serve our almighty work. Lord Inos. He can't keep anything. That's not what my husband Tell me about Inos. Inos, now our almighty Lord, business. is the light and the fire. He That's chooses humans to be his now. tool, giving them magic and laws. We act now. in his name. We administer justice yeah, according to his will and knowledge. preach his word. That's terrible. Now that's typical. Tell me more about the monastery. We instruct our students in all forms of magic, but that's the arts of the magicians of fire that. consist of more than these alone. Honestly, we are also well versed in the art of alchemy and in the creation of powerful runes. Like <laughs> we also make I'll excellent that's wine. Typical, isn't it? What are you what doing in town? Been. I have discussions with the paladins really? and support the citizens with my advice and with helpful words. Particularly now. in these difficult times, it is our duty to be there for the people and to help the poor. I don't believe that. I can't take care of everything for everyone. I heard rumors about a statuette Someone's you have supposedly lost. Have you now? You He's can only have He's heard that from like that. Vatras, the water mage. He can't What's the problem? A very valuable statuette has been sent to say. the monastery from the mainland, That's but it never arrived at too. the monastery. Has the ship been raided? No. Someone's gotta do the work. It got to Corinus, safe and sound, and up. I went to collect it there. Then, really when I was on my way to the monastery, Honestly, a band of goblins got typical, hold of it. Now, don't you no, look at me that way. That. We magicians are only human too, you know. Don't tell this to anyone. Now, that's typical. You have magic at your disposal, man. Someone's gotta do now, Didn't you try to get that it? statuette back? Of he course I did it. I searched for it high and low, and but to no avail. Everything for everybody. These are bad times. Really? Where was How it that you lost that statuette? I was on he my way to the anything monastery. To Near Orland's Someone's Tavern. Gotta do I won't tell her a thing from now on. Orland's Tavern? I Where would that be? If you leave the city by the this gate here terrible, and simply follow the path, you will come That's to a house that stands by itself. 
That's Orlan's tavern. Is it? The dead harpy. Don't tell the I see. You said that the That's goblins have it now? They stole it and made off no, into the typical, underbrush with it. I never saw that's them not again. What I heard. They're probably holding up in some pit in that. the ground. I've heard enough. I'll work. find the thing for you. May Inos if I guide you and eyes. protect you from the dangers that that's await you outside the city gates. Don't tell them. Thank you for the blessing, I suppose. He simply talks too much. I'm wondering. Will I be capable of assisting my good friend Bartok here? Why do I keep saying Bartok? He's not Bartok. Oh, he is Bartok. That's not what I heard. But uh, I'm gonna try to see if I he can say. assist him with staying alive with the wolves. Someone's gotta do the Because if that work. is the case, then I can easily get the apprenticeship he now instead of first going to Laris and then in if the I next episode traveling around eyes. a bit and thus getting the wolf skins. I don't believe that. How's it going? You're not from around here, are you? Never mind. Not Neither am I. Where did you hang around before? In the woods, hunting scavengers and wolves, together with some hunters. You don't say. But I gave it up. These are dangerous times. There's a lot of riffraff running around out there. And Where can I find the other hunters? We had our camp outside near the tavern, halfway to Onar's farm. But I don't know whether there is anyone left in the camp now. There used to be two of us here in town, until a few days ago. My friend Trokar is an excellent hunter. Bosper said you used to work for him. Yes, I did, but he was only interested in his blasted hides. I told him how dangerous it's gotten out there. He didn't really listen to me. Well, anyway, he paid well. I can't complain about that. Can you tell me anything else about him? <laughs> Bosper had one of his bows stolen recently, in broad daylight. Some guy just waltzed into his store, took a bow, and left. The thieves are getting more and more brazen. And he works all day, too. So, where is your friend Trokar now? Well, it's a curious story. Only a few days ago, we were both standing at the bar in Corrigan's Tavern, discussing the Someone's hunt. Do the work. Don't ask me what happened next. I had I had a few it. by then. I, it myself. I vaguely remember Trokar saying that he now. was going out to get a few swamp weed reefers. He That's never came back. I won't tell Where does one you. get swamp weed reefers? Somewhere down at this the harbor, as far as I know. Didn't you go looking for him? No, but I reported it to the militia. Take care of everything but everything. they haven't been able to find him yet. I hope he didn't get attacked by a wolf, or worse. And I'm afraid terrible. that I'll stumble over his body someday when I'm Isn't out hunting. Too I don't think I could bear that. <laughs> and he works all day too. Why don't we He's go hunting together? Right Hmm. With two, it isn't so dangerous, that's true. Do you know anything about hunting, then? I mean, do you know how to skin an animal? Yes. All right, but I want to see 50 gold pieces. For that, you can keep the skins and sell them to Bosper. That's a fair deal, isn't it? Where, then? You don't have the gold. All right. Someone's got to do the work. Charlie forgot. I don't have the gold. I won't tell let, her let me sell her. pearl. Sure. I won't tell her. Hey, Baltram, I've got, I've got a pearl for you. Especially for you. But that's terrible. Furthermore, any I still think that Baltram will die. Tree in the surrounding areas Wait a is minute. Strictly forbidden. Huh? Do you know? I mean, yeah. All that. Here they are. Let's go hunting. All right, follow me. Outside the south gate is a wood where we should find more than enough critters. Probably more than we'd like. I'm gonna use the magic to get the attention if needed to me. But uh, let's hope 
with this weapon it all should be able to do so. I mean, come on, that works. And Beliar spoke to another creature, but Adonos brought forth the tide, but, uh, and the creature it is was with Heiser Power, so if I don't kill them fast enough, which is most it's likely like since I'm not trained one-handed. Or two handed yet. Better off myself. Or so far went into strength and dexterity. But uh, there's only one way to find out. This is gonna be a failure. Yeah, most definitely a failure. Oh well, it was worth a shot. <laughs> Major failure one, but now that's typical, isn't it? Honestly, I witnessed it myself. Just making sure that these are done. And he works all day too. I want. Oh. No, I don't. That's what I've always said. <laughs> Someone's got to do the work. If I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. I can't take care of everything for everybody. Later. I don't have to go That's yet. what I've always said. Um, so I can't complete that one yet. I so I have to do I that one, the uh, wolf skins part with uh, Honestly, Alesta, which is fine. I couldn't get away with that. The, f the plants I will also get along the way since I have to do it anyways, you know, might as well get the plants along the way. Um, so I'm pretty and Beliar much, spoke pretty to much another ready. creature, but Adonos brought forth the tide, and the creature was washed from the face of the earth. Hey, you! How about your approval, Master? Has Vatras given you his blessing? Yes. And did you also get the blessing of a priest of Inos? Yes, I did. Then you shall have my blessing as well. No matter what path you decide to take, take pride in doing a good job, my boy. Okay, sir. Thank you. Thank you for your, uh, for your blessing. Alright, so let me double check. Yeah. So we have to go towards... Uh, Onar's farm, which is uh, which means that this is going to be the end of the episode, That's guys. Not what my husband thinks. So I want to thank you guys for watching, and if you like what you Everybody see, a thumbs it up oh, and subscribe to my channel. And uh, I don't hope to see you guys in the third episode. Don't tell me you didn't know that. The third, yeah, third episode of Gothic Two, which where we're gonna go towards Onar's farm, complete a couple of quests there. And uh, get everything ready before I'm gonna join actually the novices, which is gonna know, probably be it's either episode four or this episode five. But uh, thank you guys for watching. If you like what you see, thumbs up. I really believe if you didn't like what you see, thumbs down. Subscribe to my channel and hit the notification. And uh, you know, if you want to leave something behind, you know, make sure to use the comment section down below. And uh, see you guys next time. He doesn't see that. He can't take care that. of everything for everybody.